you know, when you talk about your core muscles and those kinds of things, I think this balance that we have this exciting, beautiful body, we really should do things to take care of it. And and I'm impressed with what you're telling us. Well, and and I see it. it it's fun in junior high. It's really fun, and 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 uh, especially in wrestling because it's such a physical workout. Right. And it really changes. It transforms. I see young boys come into the wrestling team, and they're they're stooped, uh-huh. and they're very lean. They don't have any muscles, and then especially if they stay two or three years, and then about the ninth grade year, all of a sudden their backs are straight, and there's muscle packed out here. And they carry themselves entirely differently. Now, what happens if that boy had not had an experience like that right? and gone through three years without developing that core, he probably never gets an opportunity to develop it. And so those core developments will, 20, 30 years from now, you'll see it. I've seen it. I've seen it in men all the time. And just the other day when I was driving from downtown back to our home, I passed three or four young men walking, playing texting, on, yeah. uh, well, I don't know if they're texting or if they're playing games on mm-hmm. their computers, but their physicality was, a couple were overweight and yep. some very lean, very, very yep. lean thin. Yep. So I think this is very timely for parents to be aware of this. It is. The, the issue of technology is not just that you're sedentary when you do right. it, because that's a huge detriment. You're not working your big muscles. You're not Right. You're not breathing. You're not helping your lungs. That's when your lung is developing. The other issue with technology is that you lack an opportunity to be part of something bigger than yourself. Right. We long for that. As people, we long for that opportunity to be connected. And, and Little League can be a great connection. To be part of a team can be a great connection. Right. You, can take little, you can take kids and give them a vision about their life and project that image about where they could be or what they could become. And you do that in Little League like we're going to be the winners. But if you say we're the winners, how do you measure that? But if you say we're going to be better than we were and right. what you couldn't do day one, by the time we're finished in 12 weeks or whatever that season is, you're going to be better. And in the process, you're going to be respected. You're going to be honored. You're going to learn how to interact with other people. You're going to learn how to deal with difficulty. You're going to learn how to do things that are that are hard we have a challenge we have a challenge with young people that if it's not easy they're not interested the two largest lies in our culture are it's easy and you can have it right now well okay. what have you achieved easy nothing in my life yeah. everything that's worthwhile <laughs> you work for 